So he's back. Hey. I've returned. <laughs> they let me back into the country. Yep. <laughs> Surprisingly. <laughs> I know. Especially after those letters. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to be back, honestly. The hustle and bustle of the UK. Um, I just forgot how busy it is over there. Yeah. So, you don't, don't you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it is when you're shopping. Mm. Oh, honestly, it's been non stop over there. Non stop. So, you've got to get back for the break. Yeah. <laughs> well, we say break, but within an hour, he's got his working clothes back on. Yeah. And yeah. we're ready for it. Back in. So, I've had nice clothes on for a week. <laughs> now, back into my rugs. Back into your scruffs. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nice clothes. What are them? I know. <laughs> So, obviously we've dragged everyone over to get the van unloaded because I've picked up one or two things while I was over there. Just one or two mm. little things. Mm. <laughs> the mm. van looks full, Tez. Yeah. The yeah. suspension looks worried. I was say, yeah. <laughs> 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 yeah, so we better get it out. It's yeah. not all mine. Yeah. Mostly mine. <laughs> Mostly, yeah. There is a little bit that's not yours. Yeah. 90% of it is. I think it was yeah. the box of chocolates. Yeah. <laughs> But uh, okay. we'll start getting some of that out now. We'll show you a couple of pieces that I picked up in the UK. Um, that's just going to fit in perfectly with the decor and some of the other bits that we've got going forward as well. Yeah. Yeah. So let's have a look. Yeah, but we don't day. know, so let's see. Yeah, no, no. it's exciting. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. Mixture. <laughs> All strapped in very well, I can it see. Looks like a, ca a car boat sail explosion. Yeah. yeah. <laughs>
that's a lot. Yeah, that's all the fabric sorted. Back from the UK. Yes, you could open your own fabric shop. I know. <laughs> as well as hand cream shop, as well as a flower shop. <laughs> Every yeah. shop we could open now. Every shop. <laughs> but I just want to say a massive thank you to Samuel from um, Farm Brew and Co. Yeah. He's helped us out so much with all of the fabrics. And so you've got some amazing ones here, haven't we? Yeah, there's some lovely, really good quality stuff. You know, he has, he's done well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think yeah. I might have to go for a rummage next time. Yeah, we'll get a couple of bits yeah. for the cottage and the rest for all the rooms in the shadow. Yeah. So we will go through them at a later date and we'll put a video on our Patreon account to show them which fabrics we've got. Which, what we've chosen for where. Yeah, mm, yeah, Which yeah. is exciting. Um, but if you're needing any fabrics, obviously for upholstery and chairs or doing curtains, check them out because yeah. the quality branded fabrics at like obviously a discounted yeah, good prices price. aren't they yeah yeah good prices yeah, yeah. you've been following them for quite a while have you you've noticed a lot of material for quite a while haven't you yeah Regan? on yeah. there um so i just mm. thought while i'm over in the uk uh, pay him a visit and mm -hmm. um, went to his warehouse yeah and was amazed <laughs> <laughs> and we were amazed <laughs> yeah um so i'll put the link in the the, the description and um, he's on Facebook Instagram and eBay and mm -hmm. um, so you can check him out and obviously get some fantastic fabrics yeah 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 it's, it's good really good if you if you you know you're doing something period or does he have quite a lot of modern stuff as well a mixture yeah old mm -hmm. new mm -hmm. everything right. so right. whatever you need uh, on yeah. there and um, there's a couple of bits from Ralph Lauren oh. Um, that I wanted, which nice. were heavily discounted as yeah. well. Yeah, um, it just won't go in a shuttle. No, it didn't, no. but it was nice. Um, <laughs> but yeah, anything that you need, obviously, it ships all over as well. So mm -hmm. whatever you need, you can ship out for you. All oh, right, that's good. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Super. I don't think he would have shipped all of this. No, I don't either. <laughs> <laughs> He's not that generous. <laughs> no. Um, but yeah, check him out. And for now, we'll. Uh, Get St. Cal's done. Mm -hmm. I Maybe think I better start like getting that. some windows so, so we can get some curtains in. Uh, absolutely, yes. Yeah. Come on then. <laughs> Come on then. So, while I was working on the windows upstairs, getting them sorted on the third floor, there was a bit of a problem down here back in the salon. Um, another shadow problem. Um, the wind, obviously we had the windows open and another one slammed shut <clears throat> and the old glass had obviously smashed. So obviously it wasn't held in well anyway and I was gonna get around to a store on them, um, but because I had glass in, it wasn't a massive priority. But now it's blew out and we've got no glass in and this bottom one's plastic and um, that had obviously just been put in at some point. I thought I may as well get the whole one sorted um, and bring it back. So yeah, so the other one's got all the glass in as well. That's not too bad. And it's got all of the rippled glass in. So hopefully I can try and save it. It does feel unbelievably thin though. Where I'm tapping on it feels like it's about one mil. So we'll see what we can do with that. Hopefully we can try and save it. Um, if not, then I'll have to replace it. But I'll get this one done first and then I'm gonna get onto these ones. So it's gonna be exactly the same process that I've done with all of them and the way Mum done it in the cottage door. First I'll get the panels out, give it a sand, see what needs filler in, um, then give it a lick of paint and then get the glass in. So for now, we're going to get this plastic panel out because it's just held in with a couple of screws and then we can go from there.
What have you got us into this time, Chris? Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I did just start tidying up again. Yep. And then digging. Mm -hmm. And then building. Mm -hmm. She can't help but dig and play with big boulders. <laughs> it's not little ones she's been hoying about. You could literally build a house with the size of the one you've been moving. I just can't help it. It just, like, it just happens. Yeah. <laughs> Jonathan's little veggie patch, which is just right near you here, has been such an amazing little thing. Yeah, it's just yeah, it there. yeah. It sort of made us want to do a little bit more down here, hasn't yeah. it? And just get, get it a bit more tidier down here. Yeah, and just have something grown closer that yeah. we can just come and help ourselves yeah, to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's lovely. We've got the herbs going, which yeah. smell tremendous. When yeah. you walk down there, we've got like beer and mint and rosemary, rosemary and basil. Yep. It's just absolutely And then beautiful. they're all in and they, oh, the smell is lovely. So, yeah, I mean, this is going to be our area, but it'd be great for Jonathan to start putting potatoes in yep. and bits and bobs in. And then um, we've got your little greenhouse there. Yeah, so it's ideal just to be yeah. able to come out there and pop yeah. them straight on out here. So we just want to make it a bit more tidier, a bit easier to get down, don't we? So we'll get some stones down where have you <laughs> In the meantime, it's more digging and... Cementing, so yeah. we're going to cement these stones into place. Tracy's mm. played with these. We're going to cement them all in place. Yeah, just to build a little, uh, like like I said, another little bit of veggie patch, isn't yeah. it, really? Just like this, just so we've got just some Just stones that we've found around here, so that'll put them all together and make a wall. Why not? Why not? <laughs> right, shall we get on? Yeah. Come on, then. <laughs> honest for what we need and um, just going to stick a couple of veggies in it we got it all finished yesterday really just to tidy up this area so it's going to lead down into the secret garden uh, so what I'm going to do now the reason I built this wall was to get rid of the soil in what's down there so I can clear all that so I'm going to sieve all the soil what's down there sieve it into this so we can get some veggies growing because it's quite decent stuff um, of the trees and the leaves and all the, the waste over the years so it's quite decent soil so I'm going to start sieving that now we've done a little makeshift sieve so I'll do that and uh, I'll just show you what I'm doing
Right, the next thing. This is my makeshift um, sieve, as you want to call it. I just found a bit of mesh in the in the ground, so it works quite well actually. I just chuck all the soil in that, give it a little shake, and all the stones come out. So I do keep meaning to buy one more, never get round to it. So for now, this is absolutely perfect. I'll get on with sieving some of this and um, tip it into the little thing we've made. Okay, so I'm going to just take you down now to where I'm trying to clear. This is all the area I showed you yesterday, our little herb patch. I've put this on simply because the peacocks have taken a liking to sitting on everything that we plant, basically. So if, if I put that on, um, I'm hoping it'll keep them away for a bit until they can establish themselves. So this is what I'm doing. This was completely overgrown. I, I don't know if you remember the video from last year where we cleared it all. Um, it was absolutely horrendous. It, you couldn't get down here at all. Um, so I've spent a bit of time the last, just now and again, trying to get it cleared. So I'm hoping I want a path from along there. So I'm going to make a path right the way along here and this leads into secret garden which is eventually where we're going to do some chalets it's an absolutely beautiful area so quiet so peaceful um so once this bit's cleared it's the next project is to get all this cleared which shouldn't take as long me and ash we'll be on to it no problem but beautiful area i'll just show you if you if you come out of this area just the, the views you get are absolutely tremendous um that's our orangery hey uh, just standing here it's absolutely beautiful you can see why i like this bit so much because it's so quiet i can hide down here so right my next job is to try and clear some of this get it sieved and get it in our little veggie part ready for jonathan to put some more vegetables in so we'll see how it goes. Right, that's me just about finished this now it's just about full i'm going to go and get a little bit of manure from donkey which she's got plenty of um and put a bit of that mix a little bit of that in just to make it help the veggies grow a bit more so i'm not quite sure what we're going to put in yet i'll leave that to jonathan to decide whatever he fancies um so the next step for me is to get all this raked try and level it a little bit and get some matting down ready 
for when we get some stones. Literally, I just want to try and control all the weeds. We've got so much land and so much needs taken care of. The less we have to think about, the better. So that's why I want all this, um, I want matting and then uh, gravel down just to keep control of all the weeds because there is so much. So next step is for me to go and get some raking done and um, wait for Jonathan to come home and see what he wants. So obviously I've got the windows sorted, um, got all of the filler in, so I've built up the profiles again and I've got the wood hardener on, so they're all sorted. The next stage is now to get the glass in um, and get all of the putty in, get it all sealed up and then I can put the final stage of putty on and a liquor paint to seal it all. So yeah, they're coming on really well, obviously they were in quite a bad state, like pretty much all of the windows in here. but. They're turning out really well, so I think once I've had a, a final coat of paint, um, they'll practically look brand new. So, like I said, I'll get the glass in now and go from there.
and that's the winter started obviously they've turned out absolutely amazing i can't believe just how good they look to get a full set done as well with all six pieces of glass in it just it looks amazing this is the first set that i've done which has got all brand new glass in it um, for for the full height windows and um, over christmas obviously i've done a couple of pieces of glass where i replaced it just so it was watertight but this is the first full set that i've fully restored and they've come out amazing like this whole bottom ledge was just completely rotten um, and the crossbars as well were just completely rotten so to see them now with brand new glass in and the liquor paint they're just amazing so I decided to go with three mil glass in them as well just to make them a bit stronger and um, rather than using the original brittle about one mil glass and um, we have saved it so we will try and use it somewhere else maybe in picture frames or cabinets or something like that but for the windows obviously we've just stuck with the stronger glass for now so yeah so now these ones are done i'll be able to move on to some more and get them sorted So we've got Terry back! Yay! Yep, yeah, I'm back. So we can start getting some proper work done. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, how rude. <laughs> we haven't stopped all week, have we, Trace? Not, Seems not like they've had a holiday, yeah. <laughs> Chris has been digging in the sand a little bit. We're yeah. not allowed to swear. This is a family friendly <laughs> channel, Terry. Yeah. And we all want to swear at you right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's been a super week. Um, Without I mean, me. Yeah. No, I was just about to say we're a little bit lost when Terry's not here because yeah. he's the one that does keep us going. It's not that, so. it's not even the keeper us going, it's getting the permission to do things. <laughs> yeah. Can no. I chop no. this tree down? No. No. You need to ask Terry. Can no. I do? Yes. So no. I got a bit of um, groundwork done because we know we're safe with groundwork generally. Generally. Yeah. <laughs> um, so well, well, you're saying that. chopping a tree down or yeah. pulling something out. <laughs> so we were. Planning on tidying the entrance going into Secret Garden, I thought I had lots of soil to move, didn't work for it, Jonathan needed a garden, so we put everything together, just built a little wall, put the soil just in the wall, and Jonathan's got a garden and I've got a clear plan. Yeah. <laughs> didn't really work out like that, did it? Tom? Just a just job. No, so we thought we'd just, we'd just bring some, uh, some of the blocks that we haven't used um, <laughs> over from the other side of the uh, grounds. And then we brought them over, stacked them in place, and decided that we didn't really think they were nice enough. <laughs> so then we used the stones that were stood next to where the, where we were going to build it. Yeah. To build the wall. <laughs> to build the wall. <laughs> so now we've got a nice stone wall that looks tremendous from all the stuff that was there to start with. Yeah. Yeah. If, if, if any of you do ever come volunteering here and you see Tracy come round the corner with a wheelbarrow and a spade, just run. <laughs> yes. Because you're going to be doing it for a week. And don't look back. Don't look back because you'll guilt you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. That's good because it's obviously done a it couple has, of different yeah. things. Yeah. Yeah. It's cleared all down that area. Jonathan's got some bits ready for your vegetables, haven't you, babe? Yeah. Uh, yeah. And it, it just looks a lot tidier, a lot nicer. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, it's a nicer um, area, isn't it? It is, yeah. yeah. yeah it's and good. Uh, you've been getting on with windows yeah. again. So obviously I've got another window ticked off the list, yeah. which is good. Mm -hmm. um, so there's only about 40 more to go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Put that off. But obviously it's a good thing as well because come back from the UK and brought all the fabric, um, which is amazing. Yeah. Like some of the quality of fabric that oh, we've got yeah, is just superb. Like it's way out of our budget to buy mm. um, from the manufacturers. So just using Farm Brew Co. has just been amazing because obviously it's helped us out so much. Mm -hmm. um, obviously supplies discounted fabrics, all brand new. So go on, check them online there. Um, the link will be in the description. So if you need anything for upholstery, curtains, cushions, anything. Mm -hmm. um, it's superb. Yeah, definitely. It took you a full day to dig through his stock though, didn't it? So he's got a massive uh, yeah. amount of stuff there. there. Yeah. You find That's something super. you need. And we've option. got a, another announcement. Announcement. Yay. Yeah, so obviously while I was away, we had a, a present that came. Mm -hmm. Superb. 
And this is all down to you. Yes, thank yeah. you so Everything much. Everything is down to you. Yeah. Thank you. Subscribing. That's yeah. right, Jonathan, yeah. It's the little plaque, isn't it? It, it is. It's a, is. our plaque for 100,000 subscribers. Mm. So and thank you so, so much. Obviously, we wouldn't have got to this point without all of you and your support. Mm. It was never our intention to, to grow the YouTube channel or no. have a YouTube channel this big. We used to be happy with like 100 people. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Obviously, even, the, one. Even, even one. Even one. Subscriber. Even one. That's right, yeah. Jonathan. Even one. one. Around the room. It even is. Well, I think when we had like 100 subscribers, we were all we jumping around. Got three, got three figures, yeah. Yeah, then we yeah, got yeah. To a thousand, but it's superb, absolutely brilliant. Um, we we never thought this would happen, but it's it's just brilliant. We got to be honest, we're more happy that we can share all of this with everyone. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's definitely. the main thing, isn't it? it? It does give us joy to share all of this with everyone, doesn't yeah. it? You know, what I mean? just to us, it's just our everyday life. It's just what we do, and. You know, but if it's given anyone a little bit of joy, joy. then yeah. that's amazing. Well, the whole intention for the YouTube was just to document yeah. our journey, really, yeah. for um, ourselves. Yeah. yeah. And mm. obviously, so many people just obviously want to be a part of it. And it's just been fantastic the way it's sort of... Yeah. Like evolved. It's just mm -hmm. like an extended family. And, and now, still isn't it? growing. I mean, mm -hmm. it's uh, how many how many subscribers have we got now, Jonathan? One hundred and ten. One hundred and ten. So we're up ten percent again already mm -hmm. since uh, since the plaque. Yeah. yeah. Well, so it's once, tremendous. Once we got to about a thousand, it it had changed a lot with the it subscribers. It changed a lot. It mm -hmm. did. But yeah, it did. that's it fantastic. Amazing. So just keep subscribing, keep yeah. watching. We 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 do love it. We love all your comments. Yeah. Absolutely. Obviously, so, we yeah. don't get a chance to get back to them just purely because obviously <laughs> so many. Yeah. With, well, it, yeah. We do read them. We mm -hmm. do go through and yeah. read them all. But yeah. obviously, with Facebook, Instagram, mm -hmm. and YouTube, yeah. and Patreon, we have so much to. to and get there's back also to. like the time difference. If we don't sort of. Um, check them out straight after the video the time difference the next day we're always busy or we, you know what i mean yeah, um, yeah. The, it, it is a we difficult we do get back to as many as we can uh, yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, so morning, it's not that we don't like, appreciate them or we yeah, don't we read do. them every we, single we do. one we, we still do read them yeah um, keep them just, coming yeah 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 well thank you so much yeah right and it's but time to get back to some um, work i think yes and we will see you on wednesday on wednesday when wants to close up another busy uh, another busy week yep all around the cottage as well mm -hmm. so and outside so yeah that'll mm -hmm. be uh, something to look forward to and so as usual hope you've enjoyed uh, watching terry's tales of his little shopping trip and uh, yep. yeah. while we've been slogging away <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> so if you have please share with your friends and uh, and like subscribe if you haven't because as you can see it's a massive uh, massive yeah, thing for us mm -hmm. and uh, as usual terry will be putting a, a banner across the bottom somewhere with with all our um, Facebook, Instagram and YouTube details there. So until Wednesday, we're off to do a little bit more bit work. More. Okay. Yep. See you later. See you Bye. later. Bye. Bye. If you'd like to join us on our family journey, bring them back this once forgotten chateau, then please join us on Patreon for behind the scenes footage, updates, live chat and your very own piece of the chateau.